Hello everyone, and welcome back to another fun-filled episode of Factory Town. So if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and give it a like. You can give it a like after you see the video. But please hit that subscribe button, it would really help out my channel. It would take you two seconds to do. Subscribe to the channel for more Factory Town videos, Timberborn videos, Satisfactory, you name it. Well, if you name the five things that I'm playing, I play it. <laughs> Otherwise, I don't play it. But I'm always open to suggestion, and if there are any game developers out there that like to give out keys to certain types of games I why there's a step there there's not a step here hmm. to give out any sort of game I am very much interested and I love type of you know indie games and however else you want to call it and I'd be happy to play them if anybody's watching to get a key for a game I don't even mind buying a game uh, if I can get early access to it so anyway let's get right into it so last episode we started adding housing and we are waiting oh I was going to say we're waiting for 500 research points to get the mine cars. But guess what? We have the freight cars. Boom. Hopper. Coal. This is a good place to do bulk stuff. Again, if you have a huge farming area. Tank car. Liquids. I'm not sure what the liquids would be for, really. I don't, that I don't really get. And then the box car. The box car is what I want to build right now. And I just want to see. I can build it. I just want to see that looks super cool. And what can this move? Anything you want. Anything. Cakes. It only has an inventory of 50. So it's actually not as... I actually thought it would have a lot bigger of an inventory. Didn't you? Because what do these hold? These hold 50. So, yeah, I guess it's... No, no, no. I don't know how many you can hook up to one locomotive. That's something that I... Um, again, they're not that expensive. How much iron do we have right now? 176 iron so in theory we could make a whole bunch of these a whole bunch of these These don't even take iron they just take wheels which we have 156 wheels you got tons of wheels the wheels over are going to actually be going into here and yeah that's basically going to stay i should go into this and filter this a little bit because i want this to stay as iron plate these can fill up with wheels um that doesn't we have tons of we don't even need this many wheels really do so many wheels. Why do we have so many wheels? I don't actually know. But it doesn't matter because we're full. Oh, we're not full here. Oh, um, okay. So I just want to take this, do that, and then get rid of this silo. Because silos don't work as universal uh, storages, which is kind of dumb. I, I get it, but it's more of a local, a local thing. Here, this is making... Rails, which we have 400 rails, but that's not a lot because I mean from here to here is probably 60, you know, but we want to continue on actually, you know, what we can do is we can put some more housing in. we have enough Can we just drag? Oh. If I can drag it properly, I can so that's not gonna work um, But this works this is fine. Yeah, these guys are gonna look at these these guys are leveling How do they have water that I don't understand? Because there's no... Oh! This is from the last... Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm like, why do they have water? That doesn't make any sense. It's because from before. Okay, cool. So, yeah. Sorry about that, guys. I didn't, I didn't want to rain on your parade of water. But we don't need... So we're going to take our wells. And I should have left an extra space here to put the wells in. But we can put one here and for that row and then for this row we can put that one there and we could actually you know we could actually probably put all of them here why not we have like a big well area and let's just see do we have enough flute pipes we have 200 so let's um pause this See if we can do this. I mean, there's no reason we, we shouldn't be able to. And everyone is going to grab from every side here. This one here is going to go here. All right, pretty simple so far. That way all the wells are in one little area. This well here, and this is going to go this way and go like that. 
this well is gonna go to here and drag all the way down. I mean, it's a bit, a little bit of a waste, I guess, because you can hook all of these together. I just don't know if the flow rate is enough um, to satisfy what you need. But we can just, we're just gonna do it like this because this seems, maybe I should have did that on the opposite side, but it doesn't really matter, does it? Because you can't see it. Let's unpause and watch the water. This is such a cool view too. Cause this is, these are saturated. Um, all right, these have water, don't they? I think this is what happens, they have to get to the end. So when this one builds up, the next one's gonna go here. There we go. So it's gonna take a little bit for them to get saturated here. Um, <clears throat> but it will, it should do it, right? One of these should still, should be able to supply all of these helms. I think. What happens if you just go in here and you take, uh, what is that under? If you take another well, which basically costs nothing, right? And you go into this view and you connect that. See, it's backing up. It's so it, it will just take a little bit of time. Yeah, I wouldn't have needed that other one, but we'll just leave. It doesn't matter. Oh, these guys are awesome. Like they're getting, man, they're not actually don't have that much stuff they have. This is have a level seven. Is there anything, do we have any that's at level eight? We don't. So let's just look here. So right now water we don't have because we're going to get food. We Right now we have four or five. We have six of six food. Hardware, we only have one. So we don't, even, I don't even have any stone bricks. So again, this is where having a mine, car, like having a, 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 a train system set up would make sense because you could just bust in the, the stone bricks. Now, at the end of the day, though, is these only, they're only going to want a certain amount of happiness per thing. Like right now, excuse me, food is at six. So if we send more gourmet things, there's no point. But the idea behind the gourmet things like... Um, not the fish stuff, but like, um, well, no, I'm sorry. Gourmet food is by itself. So that'd be something like an apple jam. So you take apples and sugar, that gives you a two. Right now we have zero. So you don't want to fill all these. These are just the options. Now, I'm not sure what level the houses can actually get to, like what, the, if there's a, a peak level. Um, but you have to match, you have to meet this. Right now we have zero gourmet. We have zero medicine at all. This is magical medicine. We only have basic medicine, right? Um, so yeah, it, it's tricky. So like, is it better to have a bunch of like five one point foods or is it better to, or six one point foods or is it better to have three? Because all we gotta do here is, is we have to, we have to catch, well, not catch chicken, but here we, we catch fish from a fishery and then we cook it. And this is basically a four, five, and two. This is a four four five and two yeah so it's, it's worth more than double yeah, it's double right same thing from this to this is going to be more than doubled so it makes sense to do that but is you, you can still substitute raw stuff like ki everything's done by kitchens here what is this butter butter's made from milk milk's made everything's made from pastures that's the thing everything's made from dragon fruits from dragon fruit and this is going to be apple juice pear juice berry juice etc they're only worth one um but your like your apple juice gives you six, four, and one. And an apple, six, four, and one. So the same amount of happiness, but it, it gives you four times the amount of experience. And coins are three times a month, four times, and the duration is is, um, is doubled, right? So it makes sense to do that. Now, uh, we're just starting to set this up here, right? And the box car can actually go away. And what I wanna do is, is can, how many, can we, so you can have as many food markets and general stores as you want, I gather, right? The, the, these circles, I don't understand the circles too much because you can put this, it has to be within this to count. Um, see, that's connected to that. But if you put it, I don't know, this is one thing I don't understand too much. If you put it, here, let's just do this for as a little bit of an experiment. Put this up to here, right? Okay, follow me. Let me put a food market. Well, this, okay, so this does not count. 
or is there a break there? No. See, so it has to be... These are lighting up because of that, but it, this, if this is built inside of this, it'll connect. So that's kind of the ticket here. This one is fine because of where it is, but it's almost like this should be our food, our food prep. Wow, we're running out of stuff, aren't we? Wow. You're definitely running out of things because we have more housing, right? Alrighty, I'm all over the place, but that's how I like to do things. We have iron bars. Oh, we have 300 iron bars now. That's awesome. Bunch of rails. We have everything we need to start making things here. We have bars of, this is stone brick. This is just a basic uh, a, a brick setup here, you know. <clears throat> okay. So, where do we go? What is this making? Wooden rails. What are wooden rails used for? They're used for metal rails, but we don't really need this anymore. Because we're not using wooden rails. So, we can come in here and we should just come in here and just delete um, all this stuff, right? Like, there's no, there's no purpose. These should just go to our... We don't need any of this. I, I mean, it kind of stinks to delete stuff like that, but we don't we don't need any of it. I don't even know what this guy's doing. What is this guy trying to make? I don't even know what this one's trying to do. I don't, I have no idea. I don't know. I have no idea. Like this whole area needs to be redone. Everything need, everything needs to be redone. And I think I also want to come in here and delete these resources just to give us a bit. When I mean, we have wood literally everywhere, especially with the forest right now, you're never going to run out of wood. Even in here, this I don't even know if you need if we need this anymore really right but our little town is starting to kind of take shape now eventually i want to put we can fit nine more housing over here i, I want to kind of put another block of six over here which we well i guess we kind of can do we can do that right you know what, let's just do that let's just let's just work on that yeah kind of clean this whole area up get rid of all this stuff because we have it everywhere else we don't need all of this honestly we don't this is eventually going to get redone anyway. This is fine. We have a lot of people working at this thing. And what I want to do is come in here. And oh, I always click the wrong thing. And I want to come in here. And I want to go out six houses. Two, three, four, five, six. And then we just basically just want to... Oop, we, okay, we're totally... We're tapped out now. And then this will come down to here. Like that. And, um, <clears throat> excuse me. Yeah, like that. Ooh. We must have another specialty. So, oh. Aren't we, don't we have a specialty already? Processing? I thought we had a, so you don't have any other ones because we have nothing else. Hmm, interesting. Processing. I mean, this is where using the bonuses come to play when you have like little other town centers to produce things, which we may end up getting into doing at some point. Processing. So, I don't know why we weren't selected for this for some reason. I don't, I don't really know. And then here, we don't have much stuff yet, but we're getting there. And here we got water. As you see, this is all backed up um, because this can supply. It's getting there, but it can supply everything that we need. Um, but what I want to do is, yeah, I'm just going to take this well, because this doesn't need to be here. And I'm going to put this well, um, I guess here, right? Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to grab the actual well itself. Whoopsies. And put that, I guess, here. And then build one more well. They're going to face that way. Those are facing that way. It doesn't matter. This, we're going to go underground, and then like that, and then this is going to go the same way, just like this. That's for some reason going the wrong way, and there you go. Cool. G, please. And then these are eventually going to start getting this up, but as you can tell, because we have so many more, so many, so many more, wow, we have only half of this. We have so much more housing now that we don't have enough stuff. Like we have like nothing. Everything is like trickling in. So I think this is where we need to start having multiple. Um, you can have as many general stores as you want, which is kind of cool. So I think we want to have one probably out here. Well, I guess we could just put it like this, right? Um, and then we could figure out the whole train stuff another time. Not another time, but a, a different 
Uh, then we want B, and we want to have another food market, which I don't know if it's wise. Probably not wise to put it there. Maybe put that over here somewhere. But maybe just for now, we'll just, this place is just the place. What is this? Oh, okay. I why is it not? I'm not sure why it says that. So why is it linked to zero houses? What did I do wrong here? Is this, is it not? Okay, I know. Oh, it's because it's higher because it's on this ledge. There. Now it's connected to everything. That was, I should, I should lower all this, but I'm just going to leave it for now. So the idea here that I have is, uh, we have tons of food right now. We have tons of production is get rid of, I don't really want to get rid of anything, but none of this is working probably because slow. Everything's working so slow. We're out of like, well, not out of everything, but these are, this is basically doing nothing. There's like zero point to have this. This isn't doing anything like <laughs> this point is to have that is we should start setting up, I keep saying we start setting up areas, set up areas um, for a general store, which maybe what we, we maybe what I want to do is, I'm, I'm not sure how I want to set up the whole thing about um, the rails, right? Oh, we have so much space. We already have some, can I move these tiles? Can I, can I move all of this? You can move the tile, but you can't move the bush, which makes sense, I guess, right? Um, yeah, okay, cool. So we're definitely making progress, obviously. My idea of having farms to make gourmet type foods, I think I want to, how do I bring, this is what I want. So obviously we're gonna start doing, I keep saying obviously, sorry. Bread, look up bread. Bread is definitely, a, bread only gives you one happiness though. But it gives you 20 experience points. And experience is what you need to level up your housing, of course, because that goes back to here. So you need experience to level up your housing to allow more things, etc., etc., etc. So this one gives you one happiness, but it gives you 20 experience. So this gives you a lot. So what do we need by bread? We either need... What is that? One... Is that a potato? We need one potato... And one bread to give you, I guess, potato bread, or you need two, two flours. Flours made by food mill with three grain, and then grain is harvested from a farm. So I think bread is something that we could get set up for right now. So kitchen, do we actually have kitchens available to build? Did I ever? We do. Let's just check the research one more time. I just want to see if there's anything here that would be interesting. What does this do? I don't know what a harvester drill does. Harvester drill. I don't know what a harvester drill does. Because when you hold over it, it doesn't tell you what it is. Hmm. That's 1K as well. Cargo ships. Yeah, I wish it would tell you. Oh, maybe if I do it in this way. Um, let's see. Har, so it'd be under mining, I'm guessing, right? No. Um, workers, maybe? Here. Slow moving but powerful drill with a high carrying capacity that can harvest hard minerals that workers cannot. Oh, I bet you that's used for, like, the, the, the mana shards and stuff. Airship, a flying contraption that carries. What is that? Dude, that's cool. Cargo ship, high capacity that carries many items, but I mean, this isn't like a water world. Um, I mean, there's lakes, but there's no, there's no, there's like one river system. Oh, those are fish. Oh, here's fish too. Okay, I think it's enough jibber jabber in here. Um, this could actually stay here. This is perfectly fine where this is. I almost want to get rid of all this, but I kind of don't. Um, but I think what I want to do is let's find an area back here. And let's just flatten this. Uh, what is that under? Tools. Just come through and just flatten all of this land here. 
All right, should be fine there. And then just flatten all this so we don't have to fight with different levels. And this is only taking five coins. Like, we're not even using a thousand yet. I want to flatten this whole area. Sorry, apple trees. You guys are probably going to... Oh, they just flattened with the terrain, which is kind of weird. That's really weird. Like, how, would they, how would that work in real life? I was going to dig down a bit, and you guys can still live here. Okay, cool. So, what we want to do is we want to get a, a kitchen going. A couple kitchens. Well, you're probably a couple kitchens, actually. And we want to start up by... Let's see, put the kitchen here, right? So, a kitchen, we want to make bread. Let's just say we make bread. And bread is a good, good thing, because bread will give us 20 experience points, which is really good for a one happiness thing. Like, the happiness is kind of not irrelevant, but because you want to be making profit. Or, well, you want to be making experience, which is from, well, from things. So, this needs, uh, it's made in the kitchen. It needs flour, which is produced by a food mill. So, we got to get a food mill next door. And then, oops, this is going to make flour. And to make flour, we need green from farm. And then the farm, uh, how do we get back where I was doing here? I want to flatten this terrain. I want to flatten all of this. You can kind of fill this in too. There's not real. Oh, what are those tomatoes? That's cool. Is that what that those are? Awesome. And we need a farm. We need a grain farm for this. Now I don't know how much grain we need, but we're gonna build a big farm. And see, that's another thing you could do because we're not gonna have any fertilizer right away. So that may be something that you need to work for, work towards as well. And the farm. Let's put the farm. Let's put it, I kind of just want to get, like, get rid of all this stuff, honestly. I just want to get rid of all this. I don't, we have the coins to do it. Let's just get rid of all of this. I want to come in here and I'll get rid of all these trees. And there, now we have a nice, a nice area to have a, a huge grain farm right here. Uh, there, grain farm, awesome, right? Okay, cool. So then we got to come in here and we got to put our... Now, I don't know how many farm tiles. I don't know how many of these we actually have. Fertilizer. Do we have fertilizer on our hot bar? We do not. Oh, we have 200 fertilizer. So we'll just kind of do something like this. Like that. And then also up here. And I just want to leave the front open, of course. And there you go. And I'm going to grab a well. In the what? Oh, I don't want to supply. Sorry, I want to supply a well. And the well can go right back here. And I'm going to grab a pipe. Uh, G. Oh, no, no, no. G. And this is going to come down to here. And we're going to start <coughs> G. And we're going to start watering everything. And this is going to be producing grain and we kind of come in here and we're going to go to farming and we want to plant grain now what does that actually cost oh it just cost 10 coins so we'll probably burn through a thousand coins here maybe nah not even that shouldn't be a thousand coins okay is that all of them i think so we have a couple stragglers back here which we don't need okay cool this is a fully functioning grain farm. Now we don't have fertilizer. Now fertilizer is going to come uh, later because you got to to get fertilizer. You need to use a pasture and you got to make animal feed. And animal feed is also made in here. Um, no, animal feed is actually made. Oh, shoot, sorry. Hold on, hold on. I want to go this supply water. We can go supply fertilizer even though we don't have any yet. That's what I want to have. Supply water. And these are growing. Um, it'll take a while for them to grow. But what we can do is, for starters, we can come down here and we can drag that like that. And we can put a conveyor belt in like this. So we need to make the flour, and then the flour will make this. And this we need fire for, which, guess what? We are in luck because we have... Where is it? Not a lumber mill, a forester. Oops, and the forester can go... Um and probably tuck it right here even and the forester can bring logs down and that has to go uh 
that's not what I want. I want to delete, no, oh, delete. Please delete the right thing. That, and I want to make a shoot going. There. Does this move? Oh, I thought, I thought these actually moved, which would be like super, super cool, by the way. And there we go. So as soon as this makes, which these were at, I don't know why there still says zero, zero water because we definitely have water here. I don't, that I don't understand too much. Um, I guess because it's not built up yet because we're still supplying water here. See, yields 20. Here's yield of 25. Everything else should be 25 that has water to it. We're at 51%, 50%. So as soon as these start producing, we're going to have to see when the, like it's producing slow, but we got to see once what we need. And this is going to produce bread. And the bread is going to go into a barn. What does a packer do? Which these are in like alphabetical order, not in terms of how you... A packer bundles and unpacks items to... Oh, that's interesting too. So you have to have two packers, I guess, there. And so we can have a train station. Uh, this is going to be cool. If we can get this set up properly, this is going to be pretty cool. So I almost want to have a silo. A barn will hold 200 items. The silo will hold 100. Um, so I'm not sure which is the way to go. I guess a barn would be the way to go. We could have the barn um, right here. And what we can do is we can go in here, in the storage here, and we can go, no, like that. And then this one can be bread. Simple as that. And this will be storage or input, output, whatever. And then how are we doing here? Oh, we're so close, so close, so close. But I think we're out of time for today. We're at 26 minutes. We're a little bit over time. And yeah, I think you guys get the idea of what I'm doing here. I eventually want to set up four kit or three kitchens because I have enough wood to do three. And then I can set up a couple other farms, maybe something to do with apples. because we have apples here and apples here. And so maybe something to do with tomatoes and have like three or four, well, ideally four things. Maybe another one here, another one here, another one over here. And this will be our train station, our train. Let's see, can we get one set up? Because we use this, um, something like, I don't know if it has to go like that because you should be able to. Let's look, hold on, let's look at, can we do a stop? Control here, train loader like that, I guess, right? Would that make sense? So, this is going to be item filters, bread, okay, and then oh, okay, I see, I see how it works. Okay, I'm just trying to learn how this works. And we're also going to need water for this too. So the water could go here and then this can go. Yeah. Cause you're going to need, um, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, okay. Out of this, please. You're going to need water for the, for power, right? Oh, wow. This is such a huge, um, how do I make this? So it doesn't, I guess like that. And then this one here would be uh, bread. Wow, it's 200. Okay. So that should work, right? So I should be able to drag a belt from here to here and just click on this and just click on bread. And that's going to load. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, we're making bread. Duh. I'm like, what are we doing? We're making bread. So what we can do is, yeah, we can have four different things here and we can run, well, we can run four belts into this. And this thing has like a huge amount of storage. So that way the train car can come pick up, I don't know, a hundred bread, take it into town. Oh, this is going to be so cool. Uh, what do we need? And the train would come like this, burp, 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 like that or something. And we can actually, if I grab the rail, it says, Oh, these are just unloading, loading things, but this should work fine. I don't know how to set this up differently. Uh, we'll have to monkey with that as far as how to unload or load more than one thing at once. Um, or we might just need three different train stations. I don't know, but we will work on that next episode. I want to thank you guys for watching. We're at a half an hour now. Sorry about that. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification button, and I'll catch you all in the next Factory Town episode.